Hello everyone, my name is Haven, and I am playing a scary game called Zimblan Zimblanity? Zimblanity? I guess that's how you say it. Um, this is a game I found on Steam, so I don't exactly know the story behind it, but I'm sure we'll kind of figure it out as we go. If you have noticed, I've been putting out uh, plenty of reaction videos, so I'm wanting to kind of change it up. You know, kind of do something more than scary games. Do something with that's kind of within my realm of what I am capable of, capable of doing at the moment. Because I work uh, a nine to five, so I can't exactly go and be more creative and really do much more else. So I figure, why not do some reaction videos? So hopefully you guys see that. Hopefully you like it. You know, I'm sure if you're out looking for music. I might be able to find something that you know you might be interested in. So, with that being with that being said, we're gonna jump right into this. Uh, so let's do it. Ow! Hit my hand. I received a letter from my good old friend from childhood. He invited me over to his house. He told me that he knows something about my dad, who disappeared years ago. He also mentioned that he can't talk about this on the phone, provided me with a key to his house along with the address. I'm pretty sure I know where his dad went. To the store. To get some cigarettes. Upon entering the house, I started to look for my friend. And answers. Zimblanity. The inevitable discovery of what would we would rather not know, the opposite of serpentivity. 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 You know, that almost sounds like a, it would be like a, a child's name. Serpentivity. Kind of like Serenity. Scary. Okay, let's do this. Whoa. Let's do this. Ah, uh, first. Let's check. Uh, mount sensitivity. It's pretty good. Graphics. Game quality. Let's go about high. I don't want to. I want. I don't want the game to freeze here and there. Let's do some film grain. Blue, maybe. Okay, I love the film grain. Excuse me. Thomas, is that you? Oh God, I hope not. Is that a door? Oh. It is a door. Okay, there's got to be like something around here. Can I zoom in? Yes, I can. Pretty typical. Okay. Uh, we finally started renovating the house. The bathroom is completely new. It is not having that creepy feel anymore. I'm so happy about it. Who is this Mark? My friend was Thomas. Oh. Okay. Well, didn't even get to read it. It's fine. Take. Uh, they, these tapes which you found in the basement are giving me chills. It looks like someone was recording it in the graveyard in front of the house and probably was looking for someone or something. Lily. Okay. Nothing there. I don't know why there's usually a, a rotate option because most of the time there's nothing ever really on the back of anything. Just gonna grab this. Power to the VHS. Oh my god. Something was there. Alright, let's watch this. Reminds me of VHS. Oh, wait, no, we gotta push play, don't we? Well, that actually, that might be actual footage. There's a shadow there, but there's no person there. Is 
A lot of, a lot of crows out tonight. Go to the church. Go to the church. I can't tell if that's something in the middle right there or if that's just a light. I'm so confused what that was. Okay, so before I go any further, I need to turn my PC's volume down. Not because I'm scared, but because I had it at 100%. Because I was listening to music earlier. Alright, there we go. Now it's not like blaring in my ear. I don't want to go deaf, just like a jump scare. Okay. No, I don't want to drop it. Okay, so what am I... Let's just be courteous here. And then, wait, can I eject it? Can. No, I cannot. Okay, we're gonna be courteous here. We don't want to leave Buddy's TV on. Okay, I want to go in here. Wait. Okay, there we go. I was gonna say, I don't want to go in there and like lies. Strange paper with three digit code four, five, seven. I did not want to do it, sorry. Did not want to do what? 457. What did you not want to do? Get chills already. I I did not wanna. Aw, is that is that their kitty? It's a cute kitty. Okay, so I have a I have a, a lighter. Why can't I use said lighter? Bye. Okay, cool. I was wondering. I didn't want to go wandering off into the darkness. I was about to say. The door is jammed, of course. They need something to jam on the doors. The ambience, I swear. Ugh. <sighs> Take a hit before we die here. Door's locked. Ooh, I guess I need a key. I'm assuming. So, I'm guessing we probably need to find a combination lock somewhere. Maybe we need to check through check. No, we can't check the drawers. So, oh, there's another tape. What does this tape say? Can I examine it? Oh, don't watch. That's what it says. <laughs> Lucky for you, buddy. I am not a good reader. Awesome. See, not a lot of VHSs back in the day actually had a auto rewind feature before ejecting. So, watch. This is the one we want to watch. Why should I not watch this? Is that a statue? Yeah, it's a statue. Couple statues. <laughs> Sound like the uh 
the um, Wilhelm scream. Decided to, anyways. Seven. You're still the same. I'm getting chills already because I don't know what the fuck's going on. Okay, so I, I'm assuming. I'm gonna go this way. Still jammed. So there's only one, one more stair that we can go to. Or not one more stair. One more door we can go to. Still locked. What's going on? Oh, so the candle went out. Okay, so that's a thing. I don't like that thing. What am I supposed to do? Why can't I grab these candles? Hey, can I eject this? Okay, I can't. Cool. Eject. Okay, I'll take I'll take that. Okay, I don't know what to do now because Yeah, I, I have no idea what to do now. It's gotta be something I can use. Maybe there's a lever somewhere. Ooh. Okay, I guess we're gonna turn this off. I, I imagine there's gonna be some more videotapes that I'm gonna need to find. Yeah, there's gotta probably it's gotta be some more videotapes or something. See, now that the candle's gone out, I don't Oh! Well, don't I feel fucking stupid? There's gotta be something around here. Can I just leave? Wish. Very interesting home that my friend has. There's gotta be something, man. Think, brain. Think. That's what Jimmy Neutron would say. Good brain think. There's gotta be something around here. I can't believe I used my candle up though. I feel kind of crappy for doing that. Because watch, I'm gonna really need it and I'm not gonna be able to use it. Is there another light switch around here? Okay, so. Let's rotate this. I saw a random in the bathroom. It's completely new. I'm not. It's having a creepy feeling anymore. I'm so happy about it. Okay. No. Uh, something about the tape. Oh, there's a. I swear, all these light switches that I did not know about. And a key that I should have seen the first time around. I am the uncertain. That looks like it'd be a good movie. It looks like Siren Head. Don't it? Musical instruments. Apocalyptic environment. <laughs> Look at the cute little dog. Okay, so. Stalling. I'm sorry. I just. I'll be honest, it's been a minute since I played a scary game. I think it's. Oh, wait. This is the. I need to get this key for up here. The first floor. Okay. I hate this. I, I really do. I hate this with a passion. Because I can't see. Why can't I pick up these candles, though? Door's locked. Oh, no. We all know that when there's a child's room, it, it always ends horribly. It's not the inside. Hey, Mr. Rabbit. Is there another videotape up here? We have been hearing strange noises from the basement. I have installed CCTV camera there to check out or check what is going on. 
Once I saw Dark Figure on CCTV, but when I went to check it with my own eyes, no one was there. That thing was not even on the VHS. I still don't understand it. Cameras must be faulty, Mark. Let me tell you, my friend. That is never the case. That must be the basement. Hey there. You're a rock star. Get your game on. Don't play. Weird. Let's see, why are you just standing at the camera? Help me. What's happening here? I want, wait. This is a monitor, so that means that these cameras. There's a camera in here, right? It's gotta be. So the camera. This is the camera. <laughs> Inception. Camera. This is the camera. Wait, hold on. Occultism. You know, let me tell you something. If you have kids and you still are studying in occult related stuff, like you're just asking for trouble. Now, I want to know, now that I think about it, what is that thing behind? Little rabbit. So the rabbit tricks for kids. So he's just still standing there. So Okay, wait. Hold on. I wanna see. So the bookshelf's right here. So then he He's gotta be over here, right? I'm guessing that that door that I can't get into it's jammed is uh is the um, is the basement? Sorry, I'm just like I'm trying to figure this out. Okay, so there's something right here. Wait, I wonder actually. I want to check. Is it the monitor, right? Okay, so I'm not on there. Oh, so this goes to this room. Can I have another candle? That's scary. Keep it with the phone. I want to use it as a flashlight. Can I open this up? No. Okay. So I'm kind of curious to know the mystery of this place. Mark, once you will be home, please go find our dog in that labyrinth in front of our house. When I was walking him outside, he started barking into the labyrinth and ran inside. It is getting dark and I am frightened to go inside alone. Why couldn't you go with Mark? Terrible mother. Or maybe you're the wife. I'm not too sure. I don't know. I don't know where we're at. Or I don't, I don't say I don't know where we're at. I don't know the circumstances here. Fuck. God, that scared me. I'm sitting in the dark. It doesn't look like it, but I'm sitting in the dark. Shit, that scared the fuck out of me. Oh, took an oil lamp. Light up oil lamp. Now, I wonder if I gotta collect oil. Like an amnesia. These pictures are in this. Yeah, my heart is bumping. Wait, you got a flat screen TV in here. What the actual fuck? What was with the old... Oh, wait, I was gonna say, what's with the old VHS tapes? But I feel like they're pretty old, that's why. Does this lead to the basement? Oh, yeah, it leads to that door that was um, blocked, right? Mark, don't forget to repair that hole in the floor as it is dangerous for us. It has been more than three weeks and still no repair was done. Lily's so demanding, you know? She, I bet she's the occultist. What is with these creepy pictures? Because I think I've got everything in here. Anything lore-wise, I think. I know I'm stalling. Fuck, I don't want to go down there. What sane person would? Like, uh, thinking rationally, what sane person wants to go in that fucking hole? I'm gonna get a little bit of nicotine in here. Okay. God, see that? See that right there? Oh, that's a mannequin. Okay, thank God. 
mannequin. Thank God. Okay, those are mannequins. Can I move this? Okay, I was gonna say. Oh wait, you can throw it. Take that. Okay, I was gonna say. Okay, you mannequins better not freaking move. Wait, is that? Um, okay. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. This room. But yeah, she was considered a witch. That money, she was... Oh, I gotta clear that out. Figure. Just checking around. Just turn the... Okay, cool. Awesome! So we figured it out. I'm gonna clear this crap out. Who would do that? Okay, note to whoever developed this. Um, sounds. There's no sounds to the crate or boxes. Oh, so the rest of it just fell down. Okay, if I have a run, a chase sequence, I'm screwed. Just saying. Okay, you ready for this? I'm not. I'm scared of my fucking mind. Okay, no sane person is going going down there. I wouldn't go down. I'm sane and I wouldn't go down there. Okay, I would have said, screw this. I don't need to know about my dad this bad. I'd be like, fuck it, Mark. You're on your own. Encyclopedia of Botany? Botany? Yeah. I'm being hesitant, but I'm genuinely scared to go in there. Excuse me? Where's all the bodies? Voltism, geometry. Stellar mechanics, human psychology. All right, I'm here. I'm here. Get me. Wish I could crouch behind this box. Okay, so I guess we can't read the book. Standing right here in the whole chest. Nice to know. It says rotate. Four. Is it four? Four, five, seven. Thanks for letting me know the padlock. It's four, five, seven, right? Cool. This is our house behind you. Don't tell me behind me. Ow. <laughs> that smack though. That, that was such. It could have been. It should have been like. Or some shit like that. You know. Like. Ow. Hand hurts too. And I ended up in the bedroom. Okay, let me. My head. What happened? Well, this, oh, okay, I was gonna say, what happened to my, uh, poor lamp? Let's see. Okay, now. Door is locked. Can I grab the phone? No, I cannot, buddy. Do a little thump thump on the doors, maybe. Can't go out the windows. It was raining hard out here, ain't it? Nothing I can. Oh, wait. Alas, not all hope is lost. Okay, maybe it is. Didn't find anything in any of the drawers. The drawers. Can't pick up the phone. Uh. Hmm. Okay, so what do I need to do? Watch, it's gonna say pick up the phone or some shit. 
pick up the phone. Let's find a way out. You're telling me, buddy. I feel like one of the windows would be would be the way out, right? I'm like checking the drawers again just to, just to make sure. Maybe one of these picture frames. I don't think it's supposed to get on this bed, but fuck it. There's gotta be something. Come on. No key. Can I check this? No. Ugh, ugh. No. Oh. Wow. Feels so stupid. You know, the fact that they, leave, they left this key here for me makes me wonder. Somebody's fucking with me. Gotta be, right? Is it just me, or is somebody actually fucking with me? Okay, I doubt I can go through this door. I'm gonna try it anyways. Oh, can't. Okay, I don't think I was able to go that way. Oh no, this is where I came from. This was the child's room. That wasn't there before. They knew I would step on it. Okay. Uh. Wonder what the black mass is. What is this? What's going on here? I Help me! I kill you. Silence! I kill you. Can I get in there? I, I really want to get in there for some reason. I feel like though I I genuinely feel like if I did get in there, I would not be able to get out. I did step on it this time. Wait. Okay. I was just checking to see if anything was on the monitor because I... The lights are not on. So I'm assuming... Oh, I don't need to go through there. I'm assuming that I need to leave. Door is locked. Inventory is full. Oh, the note's gone. Oh. Is the key over here? Hello? Can I help you? Apparently not. Is he gonna chase me? There's only one way to be sure. Bro, there's only one way out. Oh, he's over there. He's gotta be. Son of a bitch. Fuck. Okay. Take another hit for luck. I'm going in. What? Didn't I pick up the key? Oh, to the bathroom. Wait. Oh, it's back up here. But didn't I need to go to the, uh... Oh no, it's this way, ain't it? Is it this door? Close the bathroom door. Just for, just, just for good luck. Oh no, my face. If he gets me now. 
Oh well. There's something not right in this house. Once the renovation started, I have been hearing strange noises coming from the walls. Also, the electricity is shutting down randomly. But it was probably caused by that weird and scary electrician we hired from the wiring. Once I found him scratching some strange symbols into the walls, I kicked him out of the house right after that, and he told me that it is too late. Too late for what, Mark? Well, just want to check the back. It sounds like a dog. A rabid dog. Okay, so I got the key. So I'm going to go back downstairs. You can't scare me! I mean, you actually have been. Door's locked. What key, what is, what key does this go to now? I am stuck in this house. Uh, is there another door? I don't remember. Um... Was there another door? Besides the front door? I could be wrong. I think I've read this one, Mark. The repair, yeah. No, there's no dog sounds anymore. Who was scratching what into what wall, actually? I want to know. I want to see. Maybe they, maybe they fix it. I don't know. And I know it's not that door. Is there another door in here? Uh, the only door I can think of, because that just leads to that room. This door's locked. Yeah, I get that. Okay. All right, this door. Is there a room in here that I missed? Oh yeah, we gotta go downstairs. Maybe... Excuse me. I forgot about down here. This door's locked. Okay, holy shit. Oh, your head turned. I don't like that. I don't like that at all. Okay, so... I think objectively. There's only two doors. We have a key. There's only two doors. What door... Are we missing? Or maybe it doesn't go to a door. Right? Maybe it does not go to a door. Get out of the way. Let's do it one more time. Okay. So it doesn't go to the front door. I feel like this is moving. Stay there. You're gonna turn your head too. Like the bastard you are. don't know what it goes to but obviously I was direct I had to be a, a been direct to come down here right fair enough so down here it's just gotta be like a, a lock or something that I'm missing oh I didn't even see this oh my what's that It doesn't go to this door. It doesn't go to the front door. So it clearly, it, I, I'm assuming it doesn't go to a door. Okay, so we're gonna go back to the kitchen. I think it's the Keurig. Or the toaster. Hey, at least the kitty picture frame is just safe. That's all that matters to me. And clearly it doesn't go to the TV. The very ominous background noise. Music. Okay, there's nothing in the bathroom.
Okay, we're going back into the little kids' room. Uh, none of the drawers open. These. Oh! No. So there's this bottom. Basement door. Okay, we're going back down to the basement. Any jump scares? Nope. Nana. Fools. I kind of hate the runaround that I've got going on here. Finding more keys and I'm finding solutions here. At this point, scaring me is probably the least of my worries. I mean, I'll still get scared. Like, am I, is this where I'm supposed to stand? Alright, we're going for the front door. Can't run, so if I get chased, I'm screwed. I feel like I'm being put to a test here. You weren't there before. You weren't there before. There's the front door. Okay, long way home. I've never, I'm never going back to the house anymore. I have found a way out now. I have so many questions, but so little answers. What was that creature? Where am I? What is happening? Still no sign of my friend or any information about my father. Okay, so we ended up coming to the graveyard. Okay, how long have we been recording? Okay, 37 minutes. All right. Do this. I'm here to solve the solve the murder of my dad. Alright, wait. Well I don't know exactly that he's murdered, but I'm here to solve the mystery. Gate is locked. Oh. Hoping to find my dad at the grocery store. Oh wait. Wait, did I? I was gonna say, did I never pick it up? Let's say I pushed one and it didn't, it didn't pop up. Let me guess. I was gonna say. This reminds me of the uh, what game was it I played? Labyrinth, Labyrinthine, or something like that. Leave this cursed labyrinth until it is too late. It is feeding on your fear. The deeper you go, the more insane you become. There is no escape. There is no exit. If you are reading this note, the labyrinth probably devoured me completely. So why the fuck are you there? Why did you go deeper? I must go deeper. Too deep. Too deep. Uh, gonna guess. Might be something of use over here. No. Just some rocks. Maybe the rocks had some use. This is the deepest I've gone. Okay. So there might be something to... There's gotta be something here, right? I can't jump. Nothing. Okay. Well, I've gone as far as I can go. Sad to say, must go. Clearly the... The mystery of my father will never go un well, or will not well it will go unsolved I cannot speak where is the exit am I insane it was right here yeah it was actually right I think it was further down right no <laughs> I got some leprechauns in this bitch huh warning Avoid going through dense fog. It is not regular fog. It is literally a portal into some kind of twisted dimension. There's no way out of there. Fuck me, right? Remember 
Remember the part where I said fuck me, right? Did you hear a radio? Mark, is it you? Lily, I am sorry. It is my all my fault. I shouldn't have moved here. Greg told me it is going to be the perfect place for a per be perfect place for the family. Tell me this place has magical healing power. All I see is just pain and suffering caused to us by this place. I've lost time overview. I don't know how many days I am in this labyrinth, but I know I will not get out of here. I feel it is draining my life. I don't have much time left, Mark. And I'm sorry, Mark. I'm into a labyrinth. We're only going one way. Mark's not actually dead. It's all a game. Whoa. That was interesting. I think I was going this way, right? Okay, yeah. I was going. I was like. I look fused. Whoa! You got zombies? Oh, you're looking at me. Okay. Cool. Can I read this real quick before you kill me? Hunger. Relentless hunger. This is our punishment. Punishment for, for order. Disobedience. This will happen to you as well. It will. Do not submit, submit to the order. Don't get me wrong, I want to live, therefore I would I kind of want to submit to this order. Oh god, you are twisting your head around. This was the radio I heard. How's it hanging? So, uh, hey, I'm just gonna, yeah, I'm gonna go this way, if that's okay with you. Uh, I want to find the big guy. Oh, have you seen my father? No? And just check it. Alright, let's go. These guys are pretty weird. These guys are really weird. Not as cool. The big guy. That's who I'm looking for. I'm looking for the big guy. Can't open that up. Okay, can, can I come in? No. Is there a key? Something I'm missing. Do I go back? No, I need to get in there. Oh, my key. Was there a key at that table? Something here. I think that's my dad. Okay, I guess I gotta go back. I think. Oh! This was not here before. Blue Veil of Darkness Recipe. Add two cups of still moving flesh and stir. During stirring, add one cup of blended soul torn by the spell during the darkest night. Stir until you see four legs assembling in the form or in the foam on the top of the cauldron, then let it sit until legs disappear. All this all of this is needed for the creation of 
of three blue veils of darkness. Good to know. Good to know. Okay. Oh, was okay. No, that was not there. Oh, it is a it is a code. Was not expecting that actually. Okay, so let's, let's see. Two cups. One. Two, one, four. Three. I'll say this is a well put together game. Two. No, it has to be two. Four. Four. Three. Oh. Let's reset it. That wasn't the loudest. Wait, there wasn't there a body here? Lose my mind. Key, key piece one. If you are reading this, you are in grave danger. You have entered the ground where time flows differently. You are at the doorstep to another dimension. Someone would call to hell. I hid deep in the labyrinth because I opened my eyes. I can't do this anymore. I can't be part of the order anymore. And my second note, Thomas. I bet you Thomas is my father. Check. Hello? Way too loud. Uh, okay, I was just checking. I didn't know if I needed to go to the switch. There was anything over there. Hey guys! I feel like the body's rotated. Still here, uh, hanging out. Kind of a dead party, if you ask me. I think I'm supposed to go this way. I'll see you guys later. Okay, I don't think there's anything. I think I came from here, right? Okay, yeah. I did a full circle. <laughs> ah, screwed up. Hey, don't laugh at me. Okay, here we go. Call him Greg. He used to be his name before he started performing the rituals. He is the one who created the order. He is the one who started all this. I saw his transition. He still haunts my dreams. Uh, one day he stood in the middle of the symbol. There was a dead body laying on the table, roaring flames appearing around the circle. I have heard voices of lost souls I have never heard before. It felt like we were in a hell. His soul covered in blood tore out of his body and disappeared deep in the labyrinth. Then Greg leaned forward and peeled off a piece of his skin on a shin and revealed rotting flesh. His right arm mutated into a weapon and his body became meaty red. Then I realized he is human no more. Yeah, sounds like someone who wouldn't be human anymore. This is an encyclopedia of the Tommy, or botany, my bad. Yeah. Deep down, that scared me. Don't don't get me wrong. Whoa, whoa! You got you, you you people need to just chill out, chill out. Okay. I don't 
know what I'm looking for. Oh. So, it is ever-changing. That must be the god. Okay. The Order of the Panatic Occultists, who have access to the ancient books, and with their help, they are performing summoning rituals. In order to maintain power to perform these rituals, they need souls. Souls of people. It, st it all started when you receive a letter from your good old friend, asking to meet in person because they have something really important to tell you. After you enter the house, you cannot escape. Thomas. So, our friend lied to us. If it was, in fact, our friend. He used our vulnerabilities against us. That bastard. Oh, it's a piece of the key. Okay. I shouldn't have done that. First, we took this house from the innocent family, and then I lied to my good friend from childhood. I sent him the letters to continue this ritual cycle. After that, I started to have doubts. I don't know if time dilation is already affecting my psyche, but I saw a ghost. It told me that if I truly leave the order forever, it will save my friend. So, he cares, but he's a piece of shit for still getting me involved. A true friend would never involve you in something like this. That is for certain. So I have another piece of the key. Now we need to go find uh, what maybe the last place. I hope. Hope I'm not walking all the way back here for nothing. What no? So we're walking through the mist again. Oh uh, yeah. So we are going the right way, I think. No, I think I must stop. Okay, I'm gonna go back. I thought every time I suddenly missed something would change, but you lied to me. You're fucking liars. You lied to me. You said that every time I step in the mist, it would change. Nothing's changed. Not even the slightest. Sorry if I'm like, kind of dead. Let me tell you, working a factory job is very exhausting. Did it, did it turn its head? I think it did. Wait, I don't think this was open before. How did I not notice that? There was a gate down there. Well, what's down here? Another gate. The exit, right? No, okay. Just checking. I didn't know for sure. Honestly, I don't think there should have been a path right here. If anything, it should have been blocked off. That's just me. Okay, so, now that, so this is the gate I couldn't go through before, right? Gate is locked. Okay, so I still need, I guess, one more piece. Which everything comes in threes, right? So I have... Five. Wait, no. Maybe... Maybe I do have the complete key. Maybe I'm just ri ridiculous. I almost said the other R word. Thought I was going to do a cutscene. Oh, it's saving. It's not a good sign. That is never a good sign. I didn't mean to come in here. Wait, hold on. No! Escape. Escape! Okay. Um. Oh, come on. Really? Okay, so there's a number I guess I'm supposed to call. Come on, are you serious? Oh, come on. Open it back up. I didn't. Damn it. Okay, wait. I need to load the game. This is the most recent one. Load. Okay, so I think I was supposed to exp explore the.
a graveyard. Okay, so I think I'm supposed to explore first before I go in there. Because there was nothing, I didn't, there was no combinations, numbers, or anything. So I screwed that up somehow. You know, I didn't I wasn't expecting this game to be this long, surprisingly enough. You know, most Steam games are usually about 25 15 to 30 minutes long, so this actually kind of surprises me that So we got some floating rocks. Okay. So this is what I'm needing. So I need okay, so I'm needing that fuse. So two more fuses. Okay, so there's one more fuse around here somewhere. I'm guessing it's over here, right? Here lies Thomas, traitor of the order. May this be a warning to everyone who will question the order. Okay, cool. Uh is there a fuse over here? I'm guessing I'm gonna have to check one of these gravestones, right? Look around real quick. I don't wanna miss it. So who is that then? Is that Thomas? Okay, so we're gonna check these gravestones, I guess. So I know there's one in there, so I don't need to bother with that. Not yet, because I know it's going to close in on me. I thought that was one right there. So it's probably going to be in a very obvious spot. But my question is... When it comes to being, when being locked in that, I guess... Uh, what do you call it? Tomb, I guess you would call it. What is the code? Okay, so I can't go back. Okay, so there's one in here. I don't want to go in there yet. Still gotta be another. Aha, they'll never find me if I'm back here. No. They will. Gee, I don't wanna go in there yet, because it's like, I know it's gonna close. Now, I don't know if he's gonna make a comment about it, because he didn't before. Maybe because I. Didn't wait long enough. And I feel like there's another fuse over here. But I haven't seen it. Let's check again. I'll go in here go over here one last time. I feel like Oh! It wasn't here before. I literally checked right there. Guess there's one more. One more. Okay, so the last one's in here. Here he's speaking. Okay, so we got the fuse. Oh! Read 6547854. Okay, 6547854. Six five four seven eight five four. Your call has been forwarded to an automatic voice message system. Five, seven, one, two. Hello? Hello, Mr. Tacarino? Can I ask who's speaking? This is Janice. 
Yes, sir. Um, happy holidays to you. I'm calling from the customer service desk of the Atlantic City Press. Okay. And the reason that I'm calling is, are you still getting your paper? Well, sort of, but... What happened? I, I, I'm, I'm, I'm having problems determining the, the front page. What do you mean by that? So five seven one two. Five seven one two. Oh hey. So why are you scaring me? Aren't you trying to recruit me? I think the last thing you're going to do is scare me away from this. Hey buddy. Whoa. Uh, I need this real quick, if you, if you don't mind. I don't want to turn my back on you. I just I just wanted to shove him. Was it? So is this is going to be Mark? Right, yeah, it should be Mark. He's the traitor, obviously, right? I would too. Whoa. Whoa. Okay. Three of them. Twisted reality. I cannot recall what happened on that graveyard. Why am I back in this house? What happened to this place? Am I in some kind of twisted reality? Must be. Oh. Okay, wait. There we go. Okay, so I guess I'm making my way. Back upstairs. Oh, of course the door's jammed. Hey, mannequins. I'm gonna remove these real quick. I feel like I'm gonna need to use these real quick eventually. Yeah, so I can make my great escape. Whoa. Why did you move so quickly? Bro. Excuse a fucking me. Okay, no, seriously. These are a nuisance. Not very. Oh, it's a kitty cat picture. Of course. Come down this endless looping stairs. Wait, do I? Okay, I was gonna say, do I have a key? But I don't. We were like you once. Then we became mannequins. Thank you. Was that you? Was that you? That's what I thought. Oh, I was like... <laughs> that was gonna be difficult to navigate if I had to go down these stairs like that. Hey... As long as none of you hit me, we'll be fine. No, you're not doing okay. This is gonna be a stupid question to ask. What is this? What is that? No mannequins behind me, but there's a mannequin in front of me. It's a breaking glass. Yeah, 
you got me with that one. The buildup was there, and I still let my guard down. Somebody was taking medication. He already... He's already here. Voices in my head. They drive me crazy. Help me. Horror. You ain't gotta tell me about horror. I'm living it right now. Oh, thank you. We were like you. I'll be one of us. Oh, uh, this is a recruitment process. You're hazing me. I got gotcha. you. Oh, I see you down there. I kill you. Well, why are you gonna kill me if you want me to recruit me? Help me. I kill you. That was actually pretty cool. Wait. Oh, I thought that was blood coming down. I was like, shit. You sold me. Is that okay? Wait, I want to go look. Oh, okay. So I can't go back now. No turning back. Oh, I don't have it. I have no idea where I'm going. Dead end. Okay, let me go back. Oh, okay. I was supposed to come back. Okay. Maybe I wasn't supposed to come back. I was confused. Uh, among the books deep inside the library, an instrument used for drinking a potion of wild raspberries, bitterness, and jeering contempt is lame. Lift it high. Inside it, a bloody key for opening the path you will find. Okay. So, I guess this is the ritual process. Watch, I'm gonna walk all the way this way. Only to find out I gotta go all the way back. Yeah, now watch, I'm gonna have to go all the way back and the doorway will be there. No doorway. Okay, so I'm supposed to be looking for a cup. Yeah, okay. Oh, is this it? There's the bodies. Oh. Stop. Death is not a way out of this place. Do not go there. I have been watching you this whole time. You still have a chance to get out of this place. Fucking let me out. You will live, but it will have consequences. Go. Leave now. I can't hold them any longer. Okay. Cool. Thanks. So is that my guardian angel? It is. Salvation? Maybe? get in the car, I wouldn't even try to worry about it. Oh, he can't.
Psychiatric. Patient was found unconscious at the Rhinefields Mansion. Patient is showing signs of psychos psychosis, which includes hallucinations and delusion. Antipsychotic treatment is showing no signs of improvement, but also not getting worse. Patient is under 24-7 surveillance and behavioral changes will be immediately documented. Oh, this is their first game? No way. You're lying. There's no way this was your first game. That was really good. There was no way. I, I don't believe you for a second. But that is how good this game was? I find it hard to believe this is, this is your first. Wow, this is a good game. Kudos. It was really well done. Believe it or not. Really well done. I... I enjoyed it. So this was Zimblanity, made by one person. Isn't that hard to believe? It's so crazy because it's like, for an indie game, or even just an amateur game, it was really well done, and it's hard to believe, honestly, because just of all the elements that are placed inside of it. There's a shadow right here, I didn't notice that before. But the elements to this game, that is crazy. I really thoroughly enjoyed this. In fact, it, it's so crazy because like, I didn't find any bugs or glitches as far as I know. And the story was pretty well laid out, you know? Usually with first time games, you can usually tell. Like sometimes, you know, sometimes they're short. But a lot of times there's a lot of, there may be some bugs and glitches. And maybe like, uh, the well, there wasn't really any dialogue in this, but the, I guess the dial text dialogue was perfectly laid out and everything. You know, of course there were some spelling errors, and I think that's pretty common at this point when it comes to indie horror games. But other than that, like, everything was laid out pretty damn well. So, this guy, a girl, whoever it is, did a really damn good job. So, congratulations, you did a really good job. Uh... So this was Zimblanity. I thoroughly enjoyed it. I was truly scared. You know? I mean, yeah, I was just really scared in a lot of aspects of this game. <laughs> wow. It's crazy to think about, right? So uh, with that being said, uh, if you guys have any games you want me to play, any indie horror games you want me to play, I'm down to play them. I will try it out the best I can. Um, I do plan on getting the Stanley Parable Ultimate Deluxe. It probably won't be anytime soon, but I do plan on getting that. I also plan on playing uh, Poppy Playtime Chapter 2. I don't know when I'll get to that, but I'm hoping to get to that pretty soon as well. So with that being said, hope you guys have a lovely rest of your day, and I'll see you guys in the next... Well, also drink water. Yeah, drink water, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.